TBF helping me take out the Ice Titan nice and easily. I mean, that... Oh. Oh no. Oh no. What is up, guys, and welcome back to another video of Ark Modded Reborn. I'm just here, busy chilling on my roller coaster that we crafted up in the previous two videos. And yeah, last episode we went and we tamed ourselves an amazing dragon. And today we're going to be testing it out. Like, at least first thing, we're going to be testing it out. Uh, as soon as we get to the end of our roller coaster ride over here, going through our double helix. <laughs> oh, you guys seem to really enjoy the roller coaster, so thank you for the support in that video. It's something different as opposed to just taming a scary creature, going and building something. It, it, it was actually quite fun. I enjoyed this. I'll have to do more of these wacky ideas like this in the future. But there we go. We could just, like, end up at our station and we can get out of here nice <laughs> let me just go ahead and turn off my cart but what is up guys welcome back hope you guys are doing well hope you guys are doing bad freaking tastic uh guys won't you do me a favor go ahead and hit the like button i'd really greatly appreciate it and subscribe if you're not subscribed already let's make ourselves a saddle so we want a dragon a dragon a dragon saddle and what what dragon did i actually get i can't remember it's an electric dragon, so we need an electric dragon saddle. Should be easy enough to craft up. And we can go ahead and we can test this guy out. I think it's going to be pretty cool. We also killed the uh, Desert Titan last video. They, I have seen that there is an Ice Titan that is out and about. We'll be able to go ahead and kill him this video. Just because it's like, a, it's a, they're a nice, easy, they're probably the easiest bosses to unlock engrams on because you don't have to worry about finding the artifacts and stuff like that or well, well you do you have to you generally find one artifact ah, okay let's just run over here because the dragon can't fit because dragons are big so there we go hi mr dragon friend how are you you good you good 923,000 health and it's only level 170 that is the absolute scary part do we have a like a lightning breath on you I don't seem to have it. So, like, control Q, control C, control X. I don't know. I don't. Okay. Obviously, don't have like a lightning breath. That would have been cool if we had ourselves a nice lightning breath. Let's see. How much damage do we do? How much damage? Abandoned Rex. 23k damage. That is pretty damn good. I'm not going to lie. That's like insane. And we do Torpor as well, which is pretty cool. So, that's a nice way that we can get ourselves some more creatures and oh what are you hello apex Kano. oh oh wow you are too strong i'm just going to abandon ship i'm not fighting that i also think i if i remember yeah the apex creatures are from ag reborn so i don't want to use like a parados boss versus ag creatures i need to get myself some spinos like i've got one spino that we had hatched up and tamed up and all those glorious things we got ourselves a mega manticore over there and the ice titan was somewhere down here so yeah i need i really need to make some more progress into the ag reborn mod i mean we've made lots of progress into the parados mod but not so much into the ag reborn mod and i love how i find a manticore now when i couldn't i just couldn't find one last episode when i was flying around looking yeah where is that ice titan gone he was somewhere down here i am pretty sure we should be able to fairly easily take him out i mean the ice titan is not a difficult kill and as we spoke about last video with uh it is one of my favorite bosses to fight because i just think he looks really cool has he despawned i think he might have despawned by now which is unfortunate that would have been a nice easy source of some engram points and some loot but unfortunately he does not appear to be here anymore hi friend what are you you're just a regular dodo rex can I, can I fight you? Eh. Um, there we go. Kill you. Get wrecked. We'll fight you. Whoa, you, you, you seem strong. You seem strong. Okay. Well, we'll just keep electrocuting you. That's fine. There we go. Nice. Oh, don't, don't, don't touch me. Don't touch me. <laughs> there we go. I mean, this is, I'm fairly certain this is from the AG Reborn, but you know what? I'm not doing it to tame it. I'm doing it to kill it. And it's just a regular boss. So you don't really need to worry too much about like this isn't like an actual boss creature in the mod this is more just like it's a tame that you can get so i'm not too worried but damn this like perma perma uh stun with the lightning is actually kind of powerful 
I mean, just to be able to keep biting something, keep electrocuting it so it can't escape, would actually be pretty cool. And look at that, we got ourselves some ancient polymer, we got some element, we got a Dodo Riggs trophy, place it on a wall, nice. Go ahead, pump up that melee a bit so we can get our damage nice and high. Oh, there we go. Come on, let's pump up that melee. Oh, this guy's gonna be so strong. I'm so excited. And munch. Oh. 188,000! Holy! Oh wow! Dragon is strong! Dragon is so very strong! Oh, that is so good! That is by far, I think my, I think my Broodmother maybe does the same amount, but the fact that it can fly, the fact that it can attack Foster, is just insane that's some insane amount of damage I, was, I, I mean like I was saying like oh it does like 2,000 damage on the before we've leveled it up oh it can't it can't get that much stronger can it you know oh this guy's going to be so good oh I, I'm definitely I, I love the dragon although hi what are you what are you what are you a Promius electric dodo rex see this this is something that we can uh fairly fight because this is <laughs> we dealt over 300k torpor to that why does my electric why is my electric dragon dealing torpor that is the part i don't fully understand or comprehend like that i don't know maybe that's just me but i feel like the dragon shouldn't deal torpor like i can get why the manticore does but i don't quite understand why the dragon is dealing the torpor that's a little bit confusing to me. It's slightly change of pace, but you know what? It is what it is. Let's go. Is there anything here I can fight? Anything here worth fighting? There's some um, guardian creatures. Nice. Is there any bosses? Parados bosses specifically that we can just go ahead and take them out and make it nice and easy for ourselves. No, nothing. Come on guys, show your face, fight me. Fight me! <laughs> oh, we can fight the this dragon. Okay, and <laughs> I could just lock them out. And there we go. Th that that's one way to do it. You just come in and knock out, knock out your fellow boss creatures. Oh, I'm so glad we can now actually deal with the dragons flying around our base. It's going to make it so much more safer here that I can just not have to worry, just fly in, munch them down, take them out. And I still think that the giant roller coaster just looks so funny. I, I need to come and build stuff to actually like encompass it so it doesn't just float there. But I'll, I'll, I'll get there, I'll get there. Resources take time to to uh, collect. So that, that really does just take a little bit of time to get everything done. I mean, uh, I'm working on it guys, I'm working on it. Okay. Mr. Frozen Wyvern. Hi, friend. I'm gonna kill you too. Yes! Yes! Okay, it's unfortunate he can't fly backwards. So, that that is a little bit unfortunate. It would be nice if he could just fly, like, was a little bit more maneuverable. What is that? Oh, that's Wyvern Mark. That's fine. Okay, let's go ahead, pump up the melee a little bit more. I'll start pumping up the health in a bit, and then we can get him nice and strong. I'll maybe get him to, like, 3 million health will probably be a good step to go. But oh yeah, to be able to now just park out my dragon, show myself off. Oh, that's awesome. Uh, I still need to throw out Mothra again because as I said, she got hit while I was flying around and was unconscious. <laughs> so Mothra, you are, you are unconscious. There you go. You, you can just recover there. Get, get rid of all your torpidity so that you can be nice and awake and fresh and ready for the rest of the day. Sweet. Today I want to take a little bit of a change of pace. I want to go ahead and find myself a Tyrannosaurus Rex. So the Tyrannosaurus is one of the big four from the AG Reborn mod. And the way you attain them is you need to get a female. You need to kill the female, not, well not kill the female. You need to reduce her health to below 5%. I think it's 5% or 1%, I can't remember. It's one of those two. And from then, hi King Kong. I'm just gonna avoid you. You are scary. So yeah, you need to get the female Tyrannosaurus Rex's health down to below 5% or 1%. 
and then she will drop an egg or she has a chance to drop an egg and that is how you get them and oh wow there's a phantom the phantom menace <laughs> the phantom mammoth <laughs> Oh, uh, I'm gonna find one of, those, one of those things. That is so gonna be my title. It's like attack the Phantom Menace, and, but no, Phantom Mammoth. Anyway, uh, so yeah, you need to. What is that? A Mega Reaper King. Hi, friend. Hi. Can you wanna come out there? You seem scary. I, I don't know. I think you're from AG Reborn, aren't you? Yeah. So we we can't fight that. We don't have anything that can take it in the mod. So I'm just going to have a quick fly around. Hopefully I can find a Tyrannosaurus. Otherwise, maybe we can maybe even get ourselves it. Because we've got a Spino. Maybe we could go ahead and get... Do I have a Spino? I'm pretty sure I do. Yeah, there we go. So we've got a Spino, which is level 449. So it's pretty good. He's he's strong. Don't get me wrong. But he is not quite as strong as I need. And oh, there's, an, there's a Forest Titan that spawned in. Hi, friend. Hi, guy. How's it doing? You good? You just parked here? Are you despawning? Oh, you were killed by Lystrix, the mega spider. Okay. Yeah, that. Whoops, so much for there being a forest titan over there. <laughs> and whose base is this? Hi. No, it's Tide. Hi, Tide. Oh, it's just like a little storage container, not quite a base. I don't know. I don't know. We'll have to find his base at some point, go show him off, check him out. Because I do try and show off everyone's bases, even if I sometimes forget. That's just because my memory sucks, you know. Anywho, let me do a little bit of a search and hello serpent, titan, six one, anyway. Yeah, let me go on a bit of a search, bit of a hunt, and I'll bring you guys back once I find something. Oh, ice titan's back. Hi friend. Hi. Hello. How's it going? You're right next to the dodo rex. And yeah, two dodo rexes. That's a pretty good level dodo rex, 252. I mean, I could probably tame that. What what do you need for boss tribute? So, boss. Boss tribute. So I need a broodmother trophy, dodo X trophy, dodo Ivan dragon manticore. Oh wow, so I do need to go ahead and start killing all the bosses. Just so I can make a boss tribute. Hi, Ice Titan. I'm just gonna munch at you. Oh, there we go. Come on, TBF Diawolf. We got this. We'll take him out. <laughs> TBF helping me take out the Ice Titan nice and easily. I mean, I... Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no, this is not good. <laughs> I did it. I, I didn't think it did that much damage. Oops, my bad. <laughs> That's not good. Oh, uh, what is with me and losing all my tames? The, the, the past two or three episodes, we've just lost so many creatures, it's insane. Okay, Mothra is probably still half asleep so i'm just gonna go ahead and grab my electric dragon you should come in handy you'll be able to help me take out the ice titan nice and easily and then we can just get our stuff back because no rip my little tbf direwolf i actually really like the thing i was grateful getting around I, I seriously need to get into a habit of taming more than one of a creature so i can just start breeding them because this idea of going out taming something and then losing it in a few episodes time is just a little bit annoying sometimes i know it can be really frustrating as a viewer where i'm like going out and taming something and i spend a whole episode getting it and then it's just gone in a single episode and i never use it again because that yeah that that would that sucks it, it really does trust me i feel it too i do i'm working on it we'll maybe go ahead and in between episodes i'll just go tame up a couple of the opposite gender of all the things i need and then we can go ahead and start like our whole breeding scheme although i do need to make a breeding platform to be actually do this because my base is not really suited for having creatures to breed everywhere i mean i've gone for much more of an aesthetic build at the moment so i maybe need to look into just going and expanding my base down at the bottom making a nice little platform for all my creatures to breed and yeah okay so that that's sort of like a plan of action Let's go ahead. Let's take out this ice titan. Come here, bro. Just gonna, just gonna swoop in here. Yeah, do do a little jump. That's fine. Oh, 72k damage of hit. That's fine. Nice and easily. Boom. Okay, we are taking some heavy damage from something. Okay, and uh, there we go. Just get some bites. 
and we can fly away and dodge and then we can fly back in and bite again there we go come on friend take out the ice titan take him out yeah do your spit that's fine i'll just fly around here okay dodge the swipe okay we don't want to get frozen so let's just move away because yeah the ice titan will freeze you if you're too close to him for too long so let's just get away for the moment i also need to grab my stuff so i stop freezing to death on my character that would be helpful there we go come on take you out take you out nice and easily there we go come on i don't know oh how much health do i have 270k damage oh he hit me he does 155k damage to me that's insane that really is okay uh dodge the attack and yeah, there we go like fortunately he doesn't hit very often <coughs> So you can just do this hit and run tactic but you need to be careful with it because otherwise he will just come and kill you yeah can we kill it ah, there we go dead yeah before i freeze to death let me go ahead and chuck on some of this armor there we go uh just chest piece whatever all the stuff i need there we go just give it to me please and hey we got tech gauntlets can i can i wear those oh i can't wear them i don't have the tech gauntlet engram unlocked yet okay let's go ahead and land over here hopefully the dodo rex is just going to avoid me and leave me alone because i just want to grab my stuff hi dodo rexy friend you can stay over there please please and thank you and let's get on out of here and heal about dragon as well at the same time perfect Ice Titan down, all my stuff recovered. Great. Well, hello there, little Ida's minion. Level 180. We've got a scout here as well. Get Eric Scout. Go away. Stupid, stupid little drones. I want to quickly grab this Ida's minion here. I mean, might as well. It's got a nice high level to it. I mean, it's max level, of course. And poof. There we go. Knock you out nice and easily. Should be relatively simple. I did go ahead and craft myself up some more burgers as well, so I can get that nice and easily. Nice! Because, yeah, this can go with the uh, Ida's minion I tamed earlier in the... Uh, tamed in between episodes. So, what gender was that other one that I had? Oh, nice! I've got a male and female. I can go ahead and breed these guys. I can breed up a nice little army of Ida's minions. Because that's actually going to be really super handy for crafting things. What is that? the scout I'll, I'll take a scout why not sweet so i'm actually not too certain what else i wanted to get done i mean i'm looking around for other like dragons and I'm, there's another desert titan <laughs> these things spawn like crazy i'm not even gonna lie i mean we've killed the uh, desert titan we've killed the ice titan we do still need to kill the forest titan have i unlocked the transmitter by chance transmitter no i don't so maybe we can unlock that from killing the forest titan i don't think you can i know you get it from killing the dragon so i might have to go out and find myself a dragon there's a mega reaper king over here how much damage do i deal to you oh i missed <laughs> i don't want to get let him get to the ground okay no, now i bail now i get away from you like i'll happily chase you down to the ground but as soon as you're on the ground, I'm just getting away. And there's another one. Hi. There we go. Okay, I don't know how much damage it did to you either. Because you're also not on the ground. And there's another one. There's a Mega Manticore down there as well. <laughs> there's so many deadly things. Like I set up these spawns with simple spawners. But it's just ultimately made the world so much more deadly. Like it really has. I mean, now you've got dragons like crazy. Or you've got... An empty nest over okay. here. Oh, wait, nope. There's um, a rock drag egg in there. Oh, we got a little blue penguin as well. Get rid of you. But yeah, there's. Oh, hi, friend. Alduin is over here. Great. Yeah, as I can, as I said, this place is deadly now. You don't, you don't really want to be close to these guys because they will wreck you. They will completely destroy your life. So Alduin is one of the, the final bosses from the AG Reborn mod who 
kind of scared of don't really want to get too close to him because he will absolutely ruin your day and he won't care there we go just continue our on my quest to just farm up souls nope there is another forest titan alive but i think i think he might have despawned already or died because he, he seems to die pretty quickly to some of these creatures in this mod oh wait no he's still there he's right next to the apex there, there's vul vul thuriel you know okay let's just go ahead and take out this forest titan no it's despawning again no Every time I come past, the forest titan just despawns. Oh, that is so annoying. You know, I, I just want to fight it. Like, get get my get my work with them, you know. Just take him out. Kill him nice and easily. But no. As soon as I get close, he just despawns and decides, I am out. I am not going to touch you guys. So, oh, I almost hit a phantom. <gasps> that would have been so bad. What is it? Phantom Gacha. 36.8 million health. Yeah, that, that's terrifying. And we got some SCPs over here right next to a Mega Reaper King. Right, that's bad. Do not want to be next to the Mega Reaper King. Although he is taking a lot of damage from these guys. From the SCP Titans. Like, he's taking a ton of bleed and, you know, that's... Could be bad for me or maybe it's good for me. Oh, no, there we go. Hey, we got the SCP-610 worm nodule. Sweet. <laughs> and yeah, now he's just going straight under the ground. And look at that. Two Mega Reaper Kings, right? <laughs> right next to the Mega... Right next to the regular Reaper King, level 350. Oh, that's maybe something I should get, is get myself a Reaper? Oh, that could be pretty sick. And we are still here in the land of the unlimited spawning fire wyverns, because for whatever reason, they still just spawn like crazy out here i mean there's a what is that that's an apex uteraptor over there but the wyverns are still just spawning like crazy i'm running egg wipes every so often and then i come back in <gasps> oh no 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 no! please 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 let me up let me up <laughs> uh, there's a robo gorilla and a mega king kong mega gorilla over here that is that is horrifying but you know what i think that's gonna be it Guys, I hope you've enjoyed this one. Hope to see you in the next one. Cheers for now, guys. Have a fantastic day. Goodbye. Woo!